Generating your own electricity from the sun or other sources is doable, but not cheap. A solar system like this can cost 50 grand or more. But if you can't afford to use the sun, you might still save some money by using your head. For example, changing from incandescent to fluorescent is a really bright idea. Five fluorescents use less power than one incandescent. What else can you do? You buy what's called a kilowatt meter. You plug your appliances into it, and you find out how much energy they're using. And a way to find out if it's appliance shopping time. You can buy super efficient appliances at specialty stores. This washing machine, for example, costs $1,200 to buy, but then it only uses $13 a year in electricity. But even if you do go to traditional stores, Energy Star appliances can still save you plenty. A real good energy efficient refrigerator might use 600 watts a day, but an old one might use 2,000 watts a day. Another place to save? Stuff like your stereo, TV, and other electronics. They could be costing you money even when they're off. You think they're off, but they're not. Your recorder, your DVD player, anything that has a remote control is on all the time. Solution, when you're not using this stuff, turn them off at a power strip. Bottom line, while a solar system sounds hot, you don't really need to spend a ton of money to save a ton of money. Light bulbs, caulking, simply unplugging things. Just spend a little energy to save some. For Money Talks, I'm Stacy Johnson.